Shariners call out Shriters Guild of America for silence on recent Israel attacks in the aftermath of the recent wave of attacks against Israel by Hamas terrorists. A group of Shariners has publicly criticized the Writers Guild of America Gwab for their silence on the matter. In an open letter addressed to the Guild, these industry professionals expressed their disappointment at the lack of response from the Gwab regarding the tragic events unfolding in the region that tax which took place over a week ago, resulted in significant casualties and widespread destruction in Israel. However, the silence from the Gwad, a prominent organization representing writers in the entertainment industry, has left many shoreners feeling frustrated and concerned. They believe that the Guild should use its platform to address pressing issues, such as the violence in Israel, and advocate for peaceful resolution open letter aims to highlight the shoreners disapproval of the gwa's apparent inaction it calls attention to the urgency of the situation and emphasizes the need for organizations like the gwa to take a stance on matters that have very can global implications the shoreners argue that their collective voice can help raise awareness and potentially bring about positive change while the letter does not explicitly outline specific demands it serves as a public call for the Gwag to engage with the issue and lend its support to the affected communities. The Shoreners emphasize that their intention is not to dictate the Guild's response, but rather to encourage a dialogue and a recognition of the significance of the events occurring in Israel. This open letter from the Shoreners reflects a growing sentiment among industry professionals who believe that arts and entertainment can be a powerful catalyst for social and political change. By urging the Gwag to address the recent attack against Israel. These individuals hope to inspire a broader conversation on how the entertainment industry can contribute to fostering peace and understanding worldwide as of now. The Writers Guild of America has not officially responded to the open letter. However, the public callout from these shoreners sheds light on the expectations and responsibilities placed on influential organizations within the entertainment industry during times of crisis. It remains to be seen how the Gwag will address the concerns raised and if it will take a more vocal stance on issues of global significance in the future.